Welcome to Syrup and the Ultimate Sweet. Here's another in indie game, and I'm joined by Max. Max. <laughs> I'm sorry. How do you get into it? I need to get into it. Yeah, no it. problem. Okay. Hey, what's up, guys? We're going to be playing Syrup and the Ultimate Sweet. Um, we got Brent. Hey, joined me. by. Yep, hello. Oh, yo. Welcome, and, uh, welcome. Here we go. I'm just gonna start it. <laughs> oh, shit, you, yeah. Do you want me to read? Do you want me to read? I'll, I'll read a bit of it. Yeah, go ahead. Shoot. In a peaceful town of magic users, there is a shop that only sells ordinary, non-magical candies, Atelier sweets. No idea what that is. <laughs> the owner is known as a candy alchemist, a firm believer in science as the superior art. Proud and ah. stubborn, she continues to make magnificent, magnificent candies in order to prove her case. He's trolling. He means magnificent, mate. Magnificent. <laughs> he trolled. <laughs> but a magical surprise waits in her basement worship. I've okay. I need to pay attention. I, I'm gonna focus on reading this. Right. Candy alchemist. This is kind of cute. Yeah. This, you said this is a REMP game. Hmm, uh, this, I don't know. Yeah. This, thing, this game was made with. Whoa. Python. Holy. That's kind of lewd. She is. <laughs> Good morning. How are you today? This is kind of lewd. What the? Double gum princess. Oh, uh, fine. I'm also fine. I feel like I should do a girl's voice. Is that I'm a also guy? fine. <laughs> here, how about I put this That's in still. Office? Can you come down here like now? <gasps> um, I would like it if you told me your name. I would tell you mine, but I was not given one. That's for her name. Syrup. Yeah, syrup. Okay, syrup and... Pastel, okay. hurry up. Candy girl. Your syrup, it is very nice to meet you. I hope we can be friends. <laughs> Dude, she's naked. Look at her. <laughs> yeah, I know. Right? Yeah, that's not happening. Yeah, that's not happening. Pastel, get down here already. Who the heck is yeah. Pastel? Why isn't she coming down? She's about to be naked. Syrup, too, syrup. it is <laughs> very important that we get know. along. Wow, she's adamant about that. Bro. Fact, you stay away from me. <laughs> I want you out of my lab right now. That's pretty messed up. What is this you're holding? What is this you're holding? It's a fucking it... lollipop. <laughs> it's a kid's candy. She's like, <laughs> she freaking yeah, out because she... she's like eating. Oh, I yeah, because like, it's the same. It. She's like, yeah, that's the whole point of candy to get eaten. Oh, she's about to get like an existential dread. <laughs> Whoa. I see, then please eat me. <laughs> what is this? This game is so lewd. What? No, Ooh, you weirdo. Look at her face. Yeah, this game is. But you have I don't know to which direction my going. purpose as candy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Do not eat the cute candy girl. I'm gonna uh, eat the candy girl. Even if you're <laughs> human shaped down alive, you do look pretty delicious. Yeah, I'll eat you. Like, you probably like straw. Oh, she's like. Peppermint flavored. Do you need me for something, Sai? Sai. Oh, syrup. Oh, Sid? So, what's up, Sid? No, I changed, no, my, I mind. changed my mind. Go back upstairs. Go back upstairs. Yeah. Oh, okay. we have a guest made of candy? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right. I'm not, I'm not sharing, sharing, so don't even ask. Wow. Okay. Yeah. That is. Um, uh, I'll just get back to work. Yeah, go sweep in the other room. I'm gonna eat those candy girl. Good, all right, candy girl. Time to see what you're made of. Candy. So you just go. You just go She's straight into. Uh, whoa. What? Get some flavor tests. Those are pretty realistic, though. It doesn't seem like your organs actually function. You're 100% magic power, aren't you? Magic. Yeah, can magic candy girl. I do not know the details of my biology, but I must be eaten. <laughs> That's what she knows. <laughs> Yeah, I'll re I can read some of this. I <laughs> see that they um, pull things out like this. Yeah, what? They just like have no visuals anymore. Dude, it's good. She's like inside the candy <laughs> girl right now. No, I was not designed. Yeah, she's like she has like had the candy girl like open up on her operating table or something. Uh -huh. Do you know where the parts from your body came from? Because most of this candy looks like mine, except covered in gross magic. That seems like yeah. a waste of uh, candy, though. Genuine. I mean, a magic golem. Dude, like that's like magic a magic candy, candy golem. golem. Yeah, you're it's, right. Dude, it's a waste. <laughs> it's a 
Uh, so <laughs> should I buy you, buy you two some drinks? Uh, what are you doing? Candy biopsy? Yeah, okay, yeah, okay, I was right. Trying to figure out which part I want to eat first. Yo. How could you say you can't just eat someone? Yeah, she said. I mean, they all look like it. candy people. He kind of looks like candy though. Dude. Or it's a girl, <laughs> I can't tell. This guy is I think like it's. Ian. I think that's a guy. This is a person. This is like a person. person. So if I told you to eat me, would you? That's different. That's different. Yeah, that is exactly mm -hmm. different. I would eat you in a different way. And no, it's eat not. Her. Eat her eat anyway. What? Wait, it's that's a girl too? Um. I think, <laughs> I, think, I think they're talking about the candy girl. You want to eat the candy girl? Oh. Eat the candy oh. Girl? <laughs> oh, I don't. I'm gonna eat the candy girl. Care. Listen, man. Oh, I've got this walking amalgam of deliciousness all laid out. Literally asking me to eat it, so I'm gonna eat it. Yeah. Slay. It doesn't matter what she's made of. I can't believe you just eat a person, don't you? That's not a person, though. Don't you have a heart? Do you want me to answer that? Sit. I can't. I don't think I can deal with this. It's too much. Dude, this guy is like. He's like seen nothing, I guess. This is like Candy Golden walks in. He's like, he's pure. He's so pure. <laughs> You've already decided on this. And she's like, she's like, she's like begging for it too. <laughs> da, 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 da. What is happening? Fine. I didn't want to believe it, but you turned out to be a lost cause after all. Do whatever you want. I'm leaving. That was your choice, Max. You're a lost cause. Whoa, I'm all you. Yeah. Okay. This is like a whole route. I'm going down already. <laughs> <laughs> I think I went down a route already. <laughs> cool. Maybe. It really does take a while to eat a person's body weight in candy hall, but all of you taste so. Are you? Oh, she's like trying to eat all of her. Yeah. Holy shit. Uh huh. This is this is, this is lewd. <laughs> I should try to make another one of you myself without magic. Of course, I wonder if I could do it. Imagine how much I could sell something like that for too. Yeah. Oh, without magic, huh? It's so sure. just normal. This is. <laughs> This is like creepy dungeon music too, like they're in dungeon, she's just like yeah, down on her. Yeah, I noticed the OS2 chain. <laughs> Why is it so creepy? What do you care? You're just candy. Oh, I see. Oh, she's like hurt. <laughs> this candy girl's like hurt now. Speaking of friends, where the heck is Pastel? Some of his stuff is missing and he hasn't come in, he hasn't come in since a couple days ago now. Couple I can't believe ago. he's throwing such a, a huge A couple days? Whoa. <laughs> that kid is so fired. Right, dude. No, but it's been a couple days. Oh, am I the ending? Syrup continued to eat the candy girl until she was no more. After countless attempts to create another, she was forced to give up when her store was closed down oh. due to declining sales. Oh wow! Dec like, this does oh, yeah. sound like an ending. Holy! <laughs> That's still never returned. Cannibal end. Can what? Candible end. Candible. Get it? Candible, oh, 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 it's not cannibal so since she's so funny, not the candy. Yeah, oh, that was, does that she was like funny. end up working for you guys and then you like clothe her and then she's like, yay. I'm not. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's, that's probably so where it goes. Down a route, dude. Let's go. I'm fucking speedrunning this shit, dude. All right. Going through their <laughs> Uh, oh, fuck. In that Hold case. Up. Fuck. 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 <laughs> it's okay. I'm going you back. still have like a second choice. <laughs> Do this again. No, no, no. He's speedrunning. Right. Do, Do not eat the Do candy, not candy eat girl. The... Stay naked, like, in front, too. Because, like, so she, like, turns into a maid girl. Spoilers. I'm not eating you. Yeah, there you go. She's like, it's like the type of spoilers like from a a lollipop right opening. Now. Is her problem? Please put me in your. Bro! <laughs> Dude, this is so catered. For it. This game is so catered. Please put me in your bro. towards a certain audience. <laughs> oh dear. Um, it's about time, Paso. So make her up. I promise that tastes good. Here, just start. <laughs> just start with the finger. Yeah, please. I said, no, I'm not going to eat a person, it's too weird. I am not just a person, I am candy. You said the whole point of candy is to get eaten. <laughs> oh, this she, oh, you like, is that why she like things like that? Because mm -hmm. you said to her, right? um, so why don't mm. you just eat her then? What? 
in this room. Bro, this guy is so weird. He's like telling me to eat her in this room. The other room, he was like telling me not mm -hmm. to because she's not regular candy. I don't eat any magic candy that acts like it's human. People do that though. <laughs> yeah, they're okay. just um. I like wishy washy. No, they. Uh, they know like. What? Uh, they know that if you, like, won't actually do it, they'll just kind of like push your buttons. Oh he's, oh, he's just like pushing her buttons. Yeah. Yeah. yeah I can see that. Yeah. Well, he's all smug about it. If I did not act human, you would eat me. Yeah. I just like if she was just like laying on the ground, oh. maybe. No, it's too late. I'm never gonna eat you ever. Got it. <laughs> no. Okay, that was... <laughs> hey, don't give up. Maybe she'll change her mind one day. Don't encourage her. Who's side? You may, don't you think she'll get like all like sticky and melty if you like give her clothes though? Like how mm. that would be so cute. I guess that would be kind of what cute. candy? <laughs> yeah, she's still kind of cute. I would not give up. I will get yeah. along with her. She get all sticky. If you want to get along so badly, stop telling me to eat you. <laughs> Past, I'll do something about this. Me. Yeah, uh, it's your fault. She's in your. Is it? Do you, what do you mean? I know exactly where this girl came from. Y you do? That Ron, which made her to torment me. Okay. Mm, this little witch. This is all her stupid elaborate prank. You forgot to lock this place up last night, and look what happened. Oh, yeah, that's probably what happened. Oopsies, my apologies. Whatever, just hurry up and get her out of here. I've got work to do. I'm not following the story at all. I'm <laughs> just, so there was a, <laughs> this is like Elden Ring lore. There's like a witch, and yeah, that's like that's all I got. And she <laughs> just, came in to turn a peppermint candy. I'm guessing that's the flavor. Of this girl, I believe she's like strawberry, and that only that her like she really literally like, has. She's got like hair that, buns, yeah. I don't know, like hair buns, peppermint. Yeah. Yes, that wouldn't would work if it eating me. I said that's not gonna happen. It already happened in another route. <laughs> it's over. You're going the wrong way. Hold on. Okay. Yeah. How do you? How do I say it? Question mark. I'll do that. You will never be able to get along with her if you keep telling her what to do. Really? Yeah. You can't tell. <laughs> she doesn't like it very much. You have to find out what she likes. Nah. I think you should just go She's back like, to. Uh, Pastel, I can't help but notice this doesn't sound like you're trying to get rid of her. In fact, it sounds like the complete opposite. All right, master. <laughs> I will find out what she likes. Master? Gochu Shin Sama? Maybe she means master of the household? This is my store, not a house. If anyone's a master, it's me. Should I have not called you master, master? Oh, it's him there. Um, just Pastel is fine. Mr. Pastel. Am I saying this right? I better master, be saying this right. Master I mean, I Pastel. I hope it's says right. <laughs> da da da. Well, that's close enough. Yo! Quit being so friendly with my assistant and yo! I thought I told you to get out of here. <laughs> Come on, sit. She's not hurting anything. You're forgetting it was mm. that. It was that bitch who made her obviously as our prank or something. Whoa! <laughs> Just watch. She'll start wrecking I'll, I'll read Pastel's lines. Oh yeah, okay. You want to read this one? <laughs> you edit the bitch up or something? No, 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 it's fine. Okay, next. Okay, I'll do the candy girl. <laughs> I don't think she ever planned on wrecking anything, Sai. Uh, are you saying I'm wrong and that she's here for some other reason? Well, I don't know. I just think... Yeah! Candy weirdo. <laughs> Who made you? <laughs> That's a secret! <laughs> I'll do Candy Girl. <laughs> sure. Candy Girl is crazy. <laughs> candy Girl is fucking nuts. Figures, why are you here then? <laughs> to get along with her up! <laughs> See? Harmless. I'm gonna make it sound like Patrick. Shut your face, alright? You wanna know you want you uh wanna know the secret to getting along with me? Yes! <laughs> Stay out of my lap. Cool, that's pretty easy. But let's give her some space for now, okay? Pastel is so like just rational and just 
Guys, normal Basil, lines straight up basil is just like oh, guys, straight up basil guys stop <laughs> you hate yeah it. yeah <laughs> why she's only why is she only listening to pastel stupid candy oh, the name sounds similar too right one more batch of these and shoot i need more tar tart tracing tart oh tartrazine Probably something like that, yeah. Something like that. Guess I'm taking a sh shopping break. <laughs> then every day after the cleaning's done, we take inventory. Yeah, Oop, she's got training a little, girl. She's got the maid maid hat maid costume now. It's like their store. I can't. I don't even know what they do yet. The candy so. store outfit. Oh, they sell candy. Okay. Yeah, they sell candy. Well, she's wearing a lab really coat. The the freaking lady. So I thought she was doing magic Is she? lab or something. Oh. I mean, what am I saying? Science. Running a store sounds like a lot of work. <laughs> Wait, how do you gotta do Patrick's voice? I have a new found respect for Hugh Master Pestle. Oh, I'm chilling. Yeah, she is wearing a straight up lab coat. Whoa. Yeah, She's like, Oka, Oka, man. What is this? What do you yeah. doing? Yeah. Oh, Sai. I'm teaching her how we run the store. Dude, I like your visors, though. It's just like, those are some, like, sick. Yeah, sick. It looks visors. like some, what's called, Steven Universe. Oh yeah, you're right. I am helping. No, 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 no. You were supposed to make her leave, not reveal all of her trade secrets. Then why'd you dress her up like that? She's cute. Would, Would you rather, rather she kept walking around naked? She needs a uniform if she's going to work here. It did exactly. So she was naked. She needs a uniform exactly. She was naked. She not work here. I want to work here for Sarah. That's a double exclamation mark. I'm gonna have to yell this one. <laughs> oh my god. Let's go. <laughs> Let's get along. <laughs> oh. Get it out. I think I think you're too loud. Holy. Am I too loud? <laughs> Maybe. Yeah. That's true. What do you what are you thinking, Pastel? What is your I need to chill. What if she really was sent here as a spy so that which can root us? It's it's like you're just handing her our business. We could use the extra help. If she does turn out to be Butterscotch's spy, I'll take full responsibility. So can we keep her? The witch's name is Butterscotch. That's pretty cute. Butterscotch. That's super mm -hmm. cute. <laughs> Magic candy golems aren't pets that said no. You think they're gonna pair? Yeah. <laughs> Probably not, right? I will work hard to earn my stay. I'm very skilled with menial tasks. Nice. I mean, they look kind of similar, Pastel, and it's true. She cleaned the whole place while you were down there making candy. Look around; it's spotless. They're like pink, they like look yeah. the same. Super pink and got made. They're like a couple. On. Yeah, I can see that. Hmm, she did do a good job. It even looks brighter than usual. Oh, I can be like a hard ass that can be like, no, psh, 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 slap in your face. <laughs> yeah, let's keep her. <laughs> but she can work here. She can work for one day. But after that, I want her out. What is what? pastel, by the way? That's a person, like, I think, right? It's just a person, person. These are, and that's a person, person. And this oh, no, like... I meant like the, the, the <laughs> name. Like, what is, because candy girl is candy. Butterscotch is candy. Syrup is sweet. What's pastel? You know what? I'm just gonna take the. It's okay. <laughs> it, it means a small candy or a lozenge. Oh, okay. So that's just before our time. And I'm gonna have to look the lozenge because I don't know what that is either. A rhombus or a diamond shape? Oh, cool. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh, so you rhombus. figured it out. <laughs> Just keep going on the loop. All right, let's go. Yeah, just go. <laughs> She's already started taking inventory by herself. What a hard worker. Inventory? What the fuck? Candy golem. She's not going to do inventory. <laughs> what are you smiling about? She'll steal your job at this rate. Candy golem's going after ah, like... Slow down. Counting candy. Well, get set set on. I need to do some shopping. She probably talks to the other candy in the shop. She thinks like they're going to like a home, but the people are just eating her. <laughs> eating <them. laughs> That'd be funny. Some nice flavor text. You wait it. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. What do you want? 
Master Pastel said that he won't handle the inventory picking. <laughs> yeah, thank god. If you're running errands, I would like to help. <laughs> yeah. She's very chill though, the candy girl. She's not like kill all humans because they're <laughs> eating candy. <laughs> Very chill. <laughs> Freaking nice. out because there's like kids coming in there, like taking bites out of like peppermint, like yeah, candy canes, like, a, like your father's like it's, a candy cane. I guess it's not that type of game. <laughs> yeah, kind of hoping it'd be. That would be so funny. Huzzah! Oh, that's like a that's a goat. Was that a Wait, goat there's person? straight up witches in it's this like world. It's like a bunch of witches. It was like a witch, yeah. So, <laughs> what are we shopping for today, sir? Some like adventure land. Tart Tartrazine. What is that? Probably like Tetrazine, whatever Tetrazine is. I like Tetrazine's in explosives. I have never heard of that. Does that make your <laughs> candy taster tastier? I have no idea. It's food coloring. It doesn't taste like anything. Oh, oh! She said. She literally, she literally said it. Mm -hmm. I was hoping we might buy something to make me taste better. You? Wait. So I want to eat you? Oh my god, yes. So she still wants to be eaten. That's so cute. <laughs> well, you're out of luck. No matter what you taste like, I'm not eating you. She totally wants to look at her face. Syrup. You are a very stubborn uh -huh. person. E yep. Here we go. Tartrazine. Mission complete. Now you can make more inventory for me to take. Yeah, I'm surprised. I'm surprised she knows what inventory is. Sure, just don't forget you're only staying for one day. It's fine with me. I'll just have to become your friend before then. Good luck with that. <gasps> yeah, person. <laughs> OST. Do you, do you hear the music? It's like a. Yeah. Like meows in there. Oh, it's. You want to do your voice? Or his? I don't oh, know. sure, sure, sure. Then. Oh, it's the Candy Alchemist. Oh my. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's that's why I was like, oh wait. Louder. Yeah. No, it's. <laughs> holy. Just gonna make Come on. Meow wow, where'd you get such an impressive golem? I thought you hated magic things, Nya. This is an impressive golem, yeah, I guess. What do you want? Gee, whiskers. I'm not so rude as to decline greetings my master rival when I see her. Salutations, Nya. Oh, she like works her butters, gotcha. You know? Yeah, I guess that is Butterscotch a spy. Oh, how polite. Nice to meet you, kitty. The name's Toffee, Nya. And what'd they call you, Miss Golem? <laughs> Your name's Candy Girl. <laughs> you just call it Candy Girl. I've not yet been given a name. Nyo ho, how sad for you, but really, Candy Alchemist, I'm very surprised to see this Mew friend of yours. Candy Alchemist, gotcha. Yes, Counterpart this. to the witch. Oh, I do not think we have to become we have become friends yet, but I'm working very hard at it. Uh, she doesn't look familiar to you. After all, it was your master who made her, right? Yeah, right. Was it? I have no idea. <laughs> no idea. You aren't fooling anyone. Cut that, Ron witch. <laughs> Jeez, that rotten witch is the only one who tried to prank me like this. She made this golem to either spy on me or try to sabotage my business somehow. Sabotage your business? Master's your best customer, Nya. That doesn't make a lick of sense. Make a lick of sense. I'm sure if she were here, she'd try to take responsibility for it, though. It takes some high-level magic to make things like that, Nya. Which brings us back to my first point. Why is the candy alchemist, who's so outspokenly out anti magic, strolling around with such an unscientific creature, Nya? That's why she's wearing a lab coat. She's anti magic. I guess. I guess. I'll admit, you do have a point, cat. Okay, jeez. Okay, so a lot of these are what? just like either abandoning the candy girl or just taking the candy girl. So I'm probably just gonna take the candy girl. Mm hmm. Cause that sounded pretty convincing. You've never seen this candy girl before. Come on, we're getting out of here. Okay, yeah. goodbye, Toffee. Goodbye, music. And that song was running so away, Nia. Well, thanks for the interesting chat. Okay, so there's like and a like, regular cat back here, too. And there's like a cat. Yeah, girl. and there's like a cat, cat person. Here yeah, too. there's like definitely double cats. There's like regular cats. <clears throat> the parent made the way home, and Syrup went straight back to work making more delicious candies. That's cute. So you like. 
she like makes candy school in appreciation for the candy girl's enthusiasm and general willingness to be helpful the candy alchemist decided to keep her as an assistant oh this is an ending isn't it is this so, an ending the golem started living with syrup and pastel at Atelier Sweets Atelier, Atelier she became a mascot figure for the shop boosting sales instantly this is so dark <laughs> What do you mean? She's just selling like her like people. <laughs> She's like their mascot. Oh yeah, <laughs> selling her. Oh oh no, we're still playing. Cool. Gel jelly something. <laughs> no. You'll think of something. I have faith in Easter Rip. What's going on over here? <laughs> she just slid in. What's going on? I'm trying to come up with the name for her. Oh yeah, they still have named her. You're naming, You're naming her? her? What Oops. happened to candy golems aren't pets? <laughs> well, I can't just keep calling her candy weirdo. You don't have to call her candy weirdo. Technically, you could, you know? That could be your name. No, we really should give her a proper name. Give you a proper name. How about Gumdrop? I mean, yeah, that's cute. That's it? Like that? <laughs> that's her <laughs> name right <there. laughs> The game's like, yup, that's her name. Yeah. I think she, I think likes, she it. likes it. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, uh, you probably taste like a gum drop. I don't like gum drops. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, I'm gum drop now. Yes! <laughs> I knew it was. <laughs> if it was syrup, she would pick something good. <laughs> Holy cow! You're doing oh, okay. Things. Hello, hello. The Chocolate Brothers are making their entrance. I'm doing all the guys. Yeah, this is you and your brother. <laughs> okay. Um, yes, we've heard your shop has gotten a lot more interesting as of late. We decided to pop in. Hello, welcome to Atelier Story. Someone say like that. <laughs> oh, Candy Alchemist, you got sugary golems for sale now? How charming. No! No touch oh, If we're story. not mistaken, isn't magic necessary in their making? Unless you found a way to create life through your alchemy? Maybe, oh, what's up to you? She's our assistant, and I didn't make her. Uh -huh. Oh, mysterious. I'm completely taken with her. May I offer you flowers, milady? Okay, I was gonna say, that was anime. That was really cute. That was a cool detail. I literally went milady. You went milady. Magic flowers! <laughs> you are a very good search. Look at her face. She's so into <laughs> Can you not do that in here? I don't want your magic dust getting all over my goods. You haven't changed one bit, Candy Alchemist. Our apologies. Dude, they're like, they're like together, together. These guys? Yeah. yeah. Syrup, you should not boss around these kind of well-dressed customers. They are very well-dressed and very dapper. Are you sassing me? It's my store. I'll do what I want. Hmm, would you perhaps be interested in selling this one? She's quite adorable. No! Not for sale. Not for sale. <laughs> You can buy any other candy in here, but this one's mine. Exactly. Syrup, I am <laughs> delighted that you think of me as yours. Yep. I own you. Don't take it the wrong way. You just work for me. Your looks are good for business. What a shame. Golems She's are said to be so good such action. excellent servants. We've come such to want one ass. of our own. Why don't you go make Who? one with your stupid magic then? Make a dark magic. Golem, you too can't do magic. Make one yourself, exactly. Oh, no, no. It's a very high-level spell that requires a focused passion. Even our combined power couldn't result in anything close to that. So, I guess she's really special, huh? I guess. Yeah, she's... I'm sure she's you could like get it if you tried. Not that I know anything about magic. Not that I know anything about magic. What if they just made her, but, like, super tiny? They could probably manage that. Like a super tiny. <laughs> super <gumdrop>. tiny. <laughs> yeah. Well, well, we'll just have to give it a go sometime then. Hmm? Now I suppose we could, we should purchase something sweet and be in our way. Yes, let's buy buy some churros or something. Caramel sounds lovely, doesn't it, brother? <laughs> yeah, caramel sounds good. <laughs> Allow me to assist you at the register. She's so friendly, isn't she? Gumdrop? Yeah, yeah, I think she overdoses it, baby. <laughs> Whatever keeps well, I'm just talking happy though. <laughs> hey, uh, Pastel, is it true 
not just any old witch can make a golem. Huh? Well, you don't see very many walking around, so that sounds about right. Any for your thoughts? Just one. <laughs> Just wondering what Butterscotch's actual skill level is when it comes to this kind of thing. Well, it's like you said, if Butterscotch didn't make her, then who did? She seems to listen to you. Do you know where I'm going with this? Ooh, a little sus. No. Someone's a little suspicious. Ask her to tell you who her creator is. Since she won't tell me, you're my only help. Dude. Dude, hey, mail confirmed? Question mark? Yeah. Oh, I already asked. When I was training her for work, no luck there. Sorry. Just kidding, it doesn't matter. Uh, I'll drag it sus. out of her some way or another. Change the subject. I'm surprised to see you out of that basement during store hours. Was there any particular reason for that? Oh yeah, we were getting a uh, food coloring. Wait, no. Uh, I was planning on... That was a different day. Okay, so I can go with gumdrop. I can do a little, 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 little pastel action. All right, just leave. <laughs> go with your gut. I'm gonna leave. I'm not. I'm out of here. <laughs> Going out today. <laughs> Would have left sooner if it, if I hadn't gone caught up talking to everyone. Thanks for that. Yeah, if I didn't, if I didn't have to talk to everyone, I would have. All right, been out. enjoy the sunshine. Maybe it'll make you a little less grouchy. She is so grouchy. She needs a drink. This is like a cigarette. Yes, basically. she is. She's smoking. Super grouchy. <laughs> Don't count on it. You like glimpses. <laughs> Oop! She suddenly came out, Toffee. What do you? What do we do? Oh, she said, "Oop." That's my word. Hey. Butterscotch. What are you doing? <laughs> Look at her face. What are you doing creepily lurking outside my store? It really hurts my feelings when you don't remember my name, yeah. Your name's Toffee. <laughs> don't dodge a question and don't try to run away. Ha 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 ha. Who's running away? This is a public road. We're Can well you... within our rights to loiter here. She's definitely doing like the Joe Samba laugh right now. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> we came to see your golem, yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> Toffee told me she's doing quite well in your hands. You know, the golem that I so magnifically, magnificently crafted. Oh, I'm sorry. Did you make it? <laughs> yep, your little spy is a pretty diligent worker. Makes it uh, worth keeping her around. I was just here to check on to check on in on her that's right see for myself how diligent she's being at um spying up close she's like drooling she's like really yeah <laughs> unless you're gonna <laughs> buy something i don't want you in my store what is wrong with this girl <laughs> i brought some dosh i can buy you candy if it means i can check out your my golem dude dosh say no more come right in whatever as long as you two behave yourselves exactly come right in dosh Oh, it's the kitty cat from before. Who's your friend? This is my master, the great and powerful witch Butterscotch. Be grateful she is gracing you with her presence, Nia. Yeah, she did not make gumdrop. Ooh, there she is. Such beautiful gummy skin. And oh, if I could just take try a bite of that hair. Uh, you haven't already? That's odd considering your claim that you made her. The, that's because I had to send her over in flawless condition. I showed her a lot of restraint, you know, but it paid off. She's perfect. <laughs> now Master is at her limit. You should let her have a taste before she loses it, yeah. Dude, she's gonna lose it. <laughs> she's at her limit. <laughs> Absolutely <laughs> not. You could have any other candy in your I, I would eat her. I would, I would eat just her. be like... Yeah, I know. I would take a bite. Yeah. Like, I don't... Like, from her cheek cruel. over here. You just <laughs> keep her all to yourself, don't you? I'll put up with it for now. Just don't forget who that golem actually belongs to. Me! <laughs> Chill. Yeah, yeah, enough whining. Just buy something and get out. And, uh... <clears throat> and don't get any of your gross magic or drool on my stuff. My magic isn't gross. And you should take this drool as a compliment. <laughs> 
Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> was this like freaking Undertale? Human, like skeleton. Yeah. 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 Oh, uh, come on, Toffee. Let's blow this popsicle stand. Let's blow this popsicle stand. Uh, next <laughs> next time those two come by, we should really just pretend we're close. They didn't buy anything. <laughs> Syrup, uh, do you dislike Miss uh, Butterscotch? She's a witch. Oh, can you dislike witches? Uh, some more than others, Butterscotch is worse. <laughs> She's kind of funny. She thinks my alchemy has nothing on her match, which is totally wrong, of course. What can you do with alchemy? Can you show us? Then why does she buy so much of your candy? Uh, I'm guessing because... Syrup actually. What's up? Created the candy girl. Oh, you think? Yeah, like accidentally or yeah, something? Yeah, probably oh, uh, using cool. alchemy. Because no matter how hard she tries, her magical candies never taste... <laughs> magical candies taste as good as mine. She probably thinks if she eats enough magical them, she'll candies. absorb knowledge. Absorb knowledge through magical candy. We're getting some more. If she really thought her magic was better, I do not think she would support you by buying so many of your candies. You should be nicer to her. Uh, whether or not she means what she says, it's her... Attitude that drives me up the wall. I'm just not capable of being uh, nice to someone like that. You're not nice to anybody. What do you care anyway? You're not nice to anybody. I would like for syrup to get along with everybody. <laughs> Is that what you created once too? For me to be friends with Butterscotch so she can get free candy from me? Uh, that is not the intention. Sai, don't give her such a hard time. She's working really hard for us. You, you were listening? Master Pastel, duh, I did not think Syrup trusts in me. What should I do? Don't worry, Grumdrop. Once she sees, sees you're a good person, I'm sure she'll come around. Right, Sai? No. We'll see. <laughs> what the heck? You didn't get my yeah, gumdrop. Uh, what are you doing in my lab? Oh, yeah, getting some lab action. Um, oh, Syrup. Thing is, I don't think alchemists and scientists are the same thing. Right, you think alchemists is like turning shit into gold, you know? That's like sort of magic too. Yeah. <laughs> I am organizing your bookshelf! <laughs> Why? What are you even doing right, right now? The store thing. doesn't open for another few hours. <laughs> Holy. Oh, I do not <laughs> require sleep. That's filthy. Anyway, you shouldn't come down here without permission and start moving my things around. I don't like it. Oh, may I come in and... You already did, but... Oh, she was trying to ask later. But whatever, I guess it's fine. Syrup, I have noticed a trend with the books in your personal library. Oh yeah, what's that? Uh, they're all very boring. She can read! She can read. She thinks she can read. That's so cool. Only one book is abnormal. It is the only one with reference to magic. Oh? Magic throw it out. Wait, isn't this? Mm, oh, yeah, it's an old family cookbook. Lore, lore, lore. Me, you, we, my grandma wrote it. Lore, lore, lore. I am mm. sensing high levels of nostalgia. She's like a robot. Stirps cold, the heart has been softened by memories from days long past. Yeah, yeah. Uh, see this page here? When I was a kid, making this was my dream. Oh, there we that go. That's pretty good. And the ultimate sweet, a legendary confection said to have been only have been it's, crafted once before by the greatest. It just looks like a the butterscotch world. sundae. Butterscotch sundae looking. It was like a banana back there too. Yeah, it's like, a, it's like a legendary cherry that you can only like find once in a thousand years. Floral rating one hundred stars. Whoa! Does it never melt? That's so tight. Those who partake in the sweet are blessed with all oh, great fortune. Whoa! Once upon uh, upon consumption, a temporary enlightened state. Oh, you get enlightened, <laughs> Is, and you find yourself crying for reasons you cannot place. <laughs> Obtaining the ingredients for the ultimate street require both magical talent and mastery of science, making oh, making it exceedingly difficult, mm -hmm. if not utterly impossible, for one person to create on their own. Yo, is this wow? The ultimate psycho and the sweeto. 
Is it yummy? Uh, only the most delicious thing to ever exist. I used to tell Pastilla I was gonna make it one day so that he could taste it. But like, the book says, yeah, you need like, magic. I guess I kinda gave up on it. <laughs> uh, Master Pastil wanted to eat this? I mean, I would. I feel like everybody would. Yeah, a long time ago. He probably forgot about it by now. So, Rob, sir. Well. <laughs> We should make it. Go ahead. You want to do gumdrop? You can do gumdrop. I don't mind. No, no, no. It's okay. Yeah. I was like confused because they're like the same color. <laughs> Even though I'm, no, I'm they really are because she's like, she's like pink, but he's like a lighter pink. Uh, like I said, I had to give up on it. You can't make it without magic, so I don't want to. Bro, it's the. It, what was it called? The Eternal Sweet, though. But we can ask. Um, I mean, a witch can help us. Exactly. Bonus gosh. Not happening. You should not give up on your dream. Dude, she talks like Starfire, right? You should not give up on our dream. This is our chance to work together and get along even more. Starfire from Teen Titans? Yeah, from Teen Titans. She's got like a, she's got like proper super. Oh proper yeah. yeah, yeah. You're always going on about that. Auto flood. Okay, uh, you're always going on about that. Are you obsessed with being friends or something? Yeah, precisely, Pre precisely. She's so smart. <laughs> All right, Candy Weirdo, let's figure out a way to make the ultimate sweet without magic. I, pfft, what are you gonna do? Like, put it, yeah, I don't know. Good, and while Master Pastel eats it, you can eat me. Yeah, I've said it a thousand times, I'm not eating you. Disappointment! Come on, I then. who the creator is. <laughs> We'll need to do some research before we go out and gather greens. You want to do some research while I do some of this? <clears throat> oh, the Choco Library? Can you eat the books? All right, keep an eye for out for any encyclopedias about plants. <gasps> Andy Alchemist, what a don't, surprise. Don't, don't. And you brought your new assistant. To what do we owe the pleasure? It is the, it is the well-dressed twins from yesterday. Are you also looking for books? No, my dear. Our family owns this library. Yeah, done. Choco library. Choco business, boys. Really, huh? You ought to have known that. Certainly, you lived here long enough by now. We're always dilly-dallying, so if you're looking for something in particular, allow us to direct you to the proper shelves. How convenient. We'll, uh, we need information on a certain plan, so if you could uh, help us speed uh, it helps me up that path bad we'd appreciate it glad to be of assistance candy alchemist we look forward to tasting whatever it is you're synthesizing Ooh, synthesizing because you're an alchemist all of the plants in this book look so interesting i would like to see some of them in person one day it's got stuff from all over the world we'd have to travel pretty far to even see half of these on an adventure, traveling with Syrup, yeah! We would definitely become great friends if we went on this long journey together. Hopefully for this thing, we won't have to go too far. Uh, oh, this page, this is exactly what we need. Whoa, 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 super, super, ultra rare, frosted cremilla, <laughs> a rare species of vanilla orchid that miraculously thrives in frozen environments. Frozen vanilla, no, 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 no. This magical yeah, plant will melt yeah, into exactly. ordinary water when removed from colder climates, but its fruit can last up to three days depending on storage temperature three. <laughs> because it inexplicably inexpec glow rose from cryotic, cryotic soil, it is believed by some cultures to be born from the tears of an ice goddess. Yo, alright. <laughs> cool. Mount uh, according Sorbet. to this, we should be able to find it on Mount Sorbet, but, but it's impossible. We definitely need magic to even have a chance to find it. You keep like saying you can't do stuff because you don't have magic and you're like shitting on magic. It's girls. Yeah, I know. Use... She's just. She hates <laughs> so, magic, but. Why do you use magic then? So we will ask a wish to help us. I am sure Butter Miss Butterscotch would. Absolutely not. Then how do you plan to get the final ingredient? So look, it's not, she just gives up. What is your alchemy gonna do, mm -hmm. lady? Look, it's not gonna happen. That mountain is home to a ton of monstrous beasts, and it's freezing cold. I'd probably die if I went on my own. I shall accompany you, sir. She probably shoots like beams of candy magic. 
you wouldn't be able to move in those temperatures. You're made of candy, remember? Oh, she'll get all frozen up. You shouldn't be able to move at all. She'll like get it. She'll like give you. She'll like become even tougher. She'll like turn into armor. Yeah. She'd be like, yeah, I'll be fine if you keep me warm. Just put me in your mouth and stop. We're not going. Dude, this. Ah, the music stopped. Ah. Who would ever go to such crazy extents just to make some special dessert? Kind of a waste of effort, if you ask me. Okay, you're putting a damper on things, sort of. <gasps> you're right, sir. It is silly. Let's quit. Are you angry? Oh, is she angry? <laughs> nope. Master Pastel would not even know that he missed anything. It really was just a waste of time. She's so mad. You just, you just angered a candy golem. What are you gonna do about it? I'm just about to kill you in sleep. Absorbed in thought, Sarah takes her time returning home. Killing sleep. Was it worth it to deny her friend what would surely be the most delicious treat in the world just to hang on to her stubborn pride? She had never thought about it before. Asking a witch for help seemed impossible for a variety of reasons, but soon she might just have to. Oh, Sai, where have you been all morning? I'm jamming. Uh, out. That's it. Guy's... Fair enough. If you see Gumdrop, could you ask her to run the register for a while? Business has been picking up, so I actually need... ...the help. Oh, uh, she isn't here? Oh, uh, uh, I thought she was with you. No, I, uh, <laughs> I might know where she went. Just keep working, don't worry about it. I'll be back. Not like I have any other choice. Oh well. Jeez. He's working out of his, so high up not of his right volition. <laughs> Meow, it's the Candy Alchemist again. <laughs> Can't get over I love song. this, like, <laughs> song. <laughs> yeah. In the background. <laughs> I need your help, you're the only one. Oh, yeah. I need help. This al uh, alchemy sucks. Please. I don't want Pastel to know anything about this. Uh, oh, what is it? Something serious? Need to bury a body? <laughs> Yo, she's down, dude. <laughs> no, come drop <laughs> ran off. I think she went to Mount Sorbet to get a rare ingredient from the snake she wants to make. Whatever, you guys don't need to know the details. Whoops. <laughs> Ah, so that's where she was going. I saw her pass by and wondered... Yeah. She seems so chill, the butterscotch witch. Like, not she's even chill, she's a problem. She's chill the main girl, for sure. Yeah. Uh, what? Why didn't you stop her? I greeted her, but that girl was on a mission. She barely even told me where she was padding off to. She just pointed to a mount mountain and said, That way. <laughs> she's like, I'm going that way to a big old mountain. You should know I have a policy of never asking too many questions. Curiosity only leads to trouble for folks like me. <laughs> Cause you're a cat. <laughs> Whole useless, stupid, dumb cat. At least that confirms she was definitely going in that direction. I wonder how far she got. She was so mean. Do you think something bad happened to her? What if she got eaten along the way? Exactly. She got all sticky in some dirt somewhere. If it's too cold, she won't be able to move, and if she doesn't come home, Pasta will get all upset and probably blame me for it. <laughs> she wants me to make this special recipe for him, and if she, if he knew she was only trying to get the last ingredient because I said I wouldn't go, well, I guess I'd blame you too. Say no more. I'll help you find dear sweet gumdrop. She's so nice. Oh, yeah, oh only if you give me a taste of whatever it is you're planning on making. She the is eternal nice. You She's want, just you very... want some of the eternal sleep? Better help. Of course you're gonna help. <laughs> yeah, at this point. Uh, That's why uh, you came here in the first I place. Need, yeah, right? I need magic anyway, so I might as well use you. One taste, that's it. <laughs> she's gonna like reach she's gonna reach enlightenment. <laughs> so down. We all negotiate the terms later. Let's go get your candy back. What about you? Cut. She was even called call the cat, but I feel like climbing a mountain with mm -hmm. us. Neo, yeah, thanks. That place is all snow and dogs. I can hardly stand the thought of it. I'm a t city dweller at heart, Nia. Yeah. Just wait right here for us, Toffee. We'll be back before you know it. Aww. Be safe, Nia. Yeah. 
I want to work for this witch instead. Oh, right. Earth change. Look at her. She doesn't even need to change. Look at look at your alchemy. Look how useless your alchemy is. I hate the gold. It's not that bad, but I guess it's different for someone who's not protected by magic. Exactly. <laughs> nope. How about I bury you in the snow to see what your magical protection does against that? I'm pretty sure she'll deck you. <laughs> oh my dear candy alchemist, aren't we supposed to be partners on this little quest? You can't talk that way to your party party member. Let's just get along. Yeehaw! Uh not you too. Say it. Question. <laughs> <laughs> Gumdrop's always insisting she wants to get along with me. Why do you? Why do I need to get along with anyone? Why can't I just do things my own way without annoying people trying to be friendly? Uh, annoying? <laughs> I didn't say we should be friends. I just think it's best if we cooperate. Fair enough. This place is gonna be pretty dangerous. I've read there's uh, ferocious wolves that'll gang up on you and rip you to shreds. Wolves? I'm not afraid of any wolves. But why are you so smug? How about a whole pack? Do you think you can take him out with your magic? Right. E she, easily. She probably could. She would like shoot a beam at them. Oh really? You're trembling. That's because of the c c cold. She's what is she doing? <laughs> she's like yeah. She's like moving around. Hey, what's that aid? Is it a wolf? A monster? Syrup, do something! Oops. I think we found Gumdrop. Oh, they found Gumdrop? Uh, she's completely frozen. I wonder if she's uh, conscious right now. <laughs> hey, candy idiot. <laughs> I told you this would happen if you came up here. You're lucky we found you. That's so cute. She's like, oh, so like someone running. was looking for her. Wolf girl. wolf girl! It's a wolf. Wolf! wolf. <laughs> Butterscotch are being rude. I've been watching this golem for a while now, wondering if anyone would show up to fetch her. <laughs> cute golem. Uh, you live around here? Nod. <laughs> We actually came to find a special plant. Uh, do you think we could take her to your house? Whoa, no boundaries to thaw while we go get it. I promise we won't be too long. Sarah, what if she eats her? That's you. You're gonna eat her. Dogs don't really have a sweet tooth, right? I prefer meat. I prefer I mean, meat. I don't know about you. My dogs eat sweets all the time. What would they want to? See, nothing to worry mm -hmm. about. That's This way is a lot more convenient than taking her all the way home and then having to hike all the way back up here for one little plant. It's not just one little plant. I don't mind taking her in. Seeing her frozen in place for so long was kind of sad. <laughs> yeah, you kind of just left her out there waiting. We don't even know who you are. Why should we trust you with something as valuable as living candy? Treat. Huh? It's my name. Now we're acquainted. My name is Treat! Alright, Butterscotch. Do you have any other problems? Or can we get going now? No, no. Glad that's settled. Let's go find your rare ingredient, whatever it was, and go home. Was it the, like, cryo vanilla bean? Sorry, she's more of a cat person. Um, Syrup, right? I smell a pretty powerful spell on that witch. Is she really okay to be here, up here, wasting that much magic? <laughs> wasting magic? Uh, spell? I don't know what you're talking about. I guess ordinary humans can't sense that kind of thing. It's plain as day to me. What the heck is this, this wolf's like saying, Ned? Anyway, it smells like something's useless. Smells like something useless. Tell her to concentrate on survival. I want to be able to return your golden later. I don't like all relying on her magic. <laughs> sure, thanks. <laughs> this is so cute. After receiving directions from Treat, the uh, pair continues up the mountain. Syrup felt at ease knowing Gumdrop was safe, but Butterscotch seemed to be having a rough time. Things only got worse as they ran into trouble. 
Menace. Menacing. Roar. Ah, real one. <laughs> His face is so put. What are you doing? <laughs> Scared off with your magic. Oh, here we go. Oh, here we go. Take this monster. Here we go. Damn. Woo. Oh. I uh, turned to pink. That was supposed to be a fireball. I don't know what happened. This is so cute. <laughs> Either way, I guess it worked. Cool, lucky break. <laughs> dot, dot, dot. Butterscotch, you wouldn't happen to have like a curse on you or anything, right? Rude. I'm not cursed. I'm completely fine. I just lost focus and messed up. It happens to everyone. Your teeth are chattering. What happened to your magic? protection is a coach she lost it I using die magic <laughs> it's windy and maybe I'm not as strong as I thought are you uh, happy whoa mm. oh. <laughs> you can deal <laughs> should use her magic should address for the weather this is what happens when you get over overconfident seriously where your mana pot shut at? up I'll make it you need me for this, right? At least you're wearing a long sleeve already. Grrr. <laughs> Dude, that wolf is just, just like pink permanently now. <laughs> mm -hmm. It came back with more? Time to go. Syrup and butterscotch escape into a frozen cave. Okay, and the witch hastily seals entrance with ice, forcing the wolves to abandon their chase. Exhausted, the pair takes a well-deserved rest. That must be cold. It must be super cold. Hey, you all right? No, this is awful. I should have stayed home with Toffee where it's safe and warm. So mad now. <laughs> so mad. She's so mad. <laughs> well, at least we should have, we should be able to find what we're looking for in here. This is the exact environment of Frosted Cremilla, right? In. Oh, Frosted Cremilla. That's right. You can just chill here if you want. I'm going further in. Bobby, a uh, yeti out there. How dare you make a joke in a time like this? You're as bad as toffee. I'm about to get some frosted cremula. Bad. Toffee is bad. Dot dot. Syrup, wait! Don't leave me alone. Oh. Oh, yep, found it. Jerk! How could you leave me behind like that? Oh, is that what we came for? Yeah, I just need to grab some of the fruit and we can go home. What's up, fruit? Good. Grab a ton so we can never come back. I'd, I'd harvest never have I'm to taking the tree. Take all you can carry. Take only what mm. you I'm definitely taking only what we need because we're on a stupid mountain. <laughs> I don't have a use for this <laughs> many, and if I need more, we've got it's, experience now. Yeah, it, be, it would it definitely be like. as much trouble for us for a second time, right? Yeah, like. You would, taking all of it would freeze you to death. <laughs> Probably uh, some kind of consequence. Thing. Get the get the vanilla ending. You'd want to go through all this again? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I think we made an alright team. You, you did nothing! <laughs> but all I did was mess up. <laughs> you actually did something. We, got, we came here for... Came, we came for, didn't we? <laughs> no, let's get out of here. All right, magic the ice away so we can get out of here. Yeah, use your magic. Right, take this. Dot dot dot. <laughs> uh, nothing's happening. Quit messing around and break the ice. Well, what if the wolves are still there? I don't hear them or see it or shadows. We should be fine. Right. Okay, for real this time. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> something wrong. I'm just stressed out, so my magic's not working right. Shut up. <laughs> so funny. Oh, no, I dropped an earring. No! An earring. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, whatever, I'll just get it later. Uh, yeah, so we're just trapped in here? No, we're not trapped. I'm a great witch. It's just this stupid spell doesn't want to happen. Oh. Come on. Okay, we're a little trapped. Huh. Your ice wall was so good that you trapped us. 
Magic is connected to your state of mind, right? Try to calm down. Um, I'm calm as brave. <laughs> I'm calm as brave. <laughs> but it's gorge. Everything is under control. My emotions are completely in check, so my magic <laughs> should be working just fine. I'm completely fine. <laughs> but it's gorge. What? Talk to me. What's wrong? I don't know, it's cold. What if I can't get us out of here? Are we gonna die because of me? Yeah, maybe, yeah, we're actually, yeah, well, uh, we're probably gonna die because you can't use your fire. Probably. Uh, no, because you're a great witch, me. remember, we'll make it. But I can't even get the spell to work. Sealing the cave was an accident in the first place. I panicked and it just... Bro, lady. Hey, you'll get it. You've got talent. <laughs> if you could make gumdrop, you can melt ice. You didn't make gumdrop. So just take a deep breath and try again. Hey, she's acting all nice now. I right. didn't. When her survival is like on the line. When her life is on the line. Um. I didn't make gumdrop. I don't know who did. I just took the credit to make myself look better. So sorry, you thought wrong. Yeah, no one believed you in the first place. <laughs> stupid ice, stupid wall. Stupid, stupid. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <Gra. laughs> Butterscotch, is your magic still going haywire because you look different? What? I. Oh, my spell came undone. Don't look at me. How does she, she look different? Did she grow like a centimeter? This body is just an illusion. It's not the real me. Uh, that's not very convincing. <gasps> she's like, she's like a tree in reality. So this is what she meant. That wolf girl from before told me you were wasting all it's your magic. It's probably like useless spell. freckles or something. It's not useless. I need it. I can't let anyone s except Toffee see me this way. Please don't tell anyone. I feel so bad because I have no idea what's different. Yeah, I, I don't see anything different. Why do you hide behind a transformation all the time? Oh, I found my earring. People don't take you seriously when you look like I do. I want to be a beautiful, fearsome witch that everyone might admires, but instead I'm... I'm... You're? Everything about me is fake, alright? I'm always lying to everyone. I'm barely any good with magic and I can't even bear to let anyone see what I really look like. She didn't she's like, change. Or she's like an ogre. Like she turns into like Princess Fiona. And now we're gonna die because I'm a big fat coward who could never tell you the truth. Are you happy? Da -da -da -da. Well, say something. Aren't you gonna yell at me? Don't you hate me? <laughs> <laughs> well, I was just, uh, yeah. I don't hate you at all, Butterscotch. I never help. What are you saying? Uh, sometimes I wonder why we're always fighting, and I guess it's because that's the way we are. But it's not like I ever actually hated you. You're lying. Why would I lie? There's no point since we'll both be dead soon enough. Unless we figure out a way here, that is. But, I mean, I thought you hated anyone who can do magic. You do, don't you? That's not it. I just... I think that being able to do things without magic takes an incredible understanding of the world and its elements, and that's awesome. So when it feels like no one else sees that, I get frustrated. Maybe I don't trust magic users in general, but still. No, I've never hated you just for being a witch. Done. What? Why are you staring at me like that? Aren't you at least gonna make fun of me for some for looking like this? Okay, she, is this like is I can't. Okay, I still need to like see what the heck is even happening with her. Uh -huh. Why should anyone care what you look like? It's not their business. You're not hurting anyone, so who cares? You just don't get it. Everyone thinks you're cool, and you don't even have to try. You don't know what it's like. You just don't get it, Spider-Man. Hey, I tried. To, I tried hard. Uh, hey, I try hard to be taken seriously too. Everyone sees my alchemy as a gimmick. It's like I'm doing cheap tricks compared to anyone else in that town full of magic users. 
Well, anyone can make decent candy with magic, but yours tastes the best. Of course you do. I'm a genius when it comes to candy making. Jeez, you're so confident. So confident I have to be, otherwise I'd just give up and do something boring with my life instead. Hey, remember the day we first met when I came into your store to make fun of how bad your alchemy would make candy taste, but then you forced me to try a piece. And you were so impressed that you begged me to teach you how to make them, but I was still so mad like best friends. And you declared us rivals. Yeah, I remember. Yeah, they're like best friends. Uh, I just think maybe if not for us, our big, big egos, we could have become friends sooner. Yeah, maybe. Thanks, Syrup. I feel a lot better. My magic might work now, so I'm gonna give it another shot. Through the power of friendship. Through the power of friendship with their mind at ease, Butterscotch is finally able to focus and melt away the wall of ice that trapped the pair in the cavern. They make their way back down the mountain without incident to an unfrozen, very relieved gumdrop. Eager to get working on the ultimate suite, they promptly return uh, Butterscotch to her cottage. Ultimate suite. Coffee, I'm home. Our mission was a success. She taller? Master, oh, your spell. Master, oh, your spell. That's what I'm thinking. I know, don't worry, it's a long story, I'll tell you later. <laughs> what is wrong with Dade? <laughs> you have a dog scent on you, those wolf didn't give you any trouble, did they? Yeah, I should've went with you, I was just being a scaredy cat. Should've, got a Aw, hey, it went just fine, calm your whiskers. You are worried about me? Why wouldn't I be? You went on a dangerous mission with your greatest rival. A lot could've gone wrong, yeah. Guess we probably shouldn't say anything about almost freezing to death then. What? She's joking, she's joking. Anyway, I shouldn't keep gumdrop waiting outside. See ya. Hey, before you go, there's one more thing I should tell you about. Promise you won't hate me? Promise? Oh, okay. I... I've been using this crystal ball to spy on you. Sometimes <laughs> I'm really sorry. <laughs> Is letting it all out. What? What? what, what? Here, take it. I won't use it anymore. I know it was bad, but I wanted to try to learn how you make candy what, so what, I could do it myself. What, what? I just need like 10 like Bollywood like spit takes. What? 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 <laughs> but your science is just too confusing. I couldn't figure it out at all, so it was all for nothing. I'm really, really sorry. Um, thanks for telling me, I guess. You don't hate me? <laughs> said I wouldn't. <laughs> you, I wasn't sure how you'd take it. I thought you'd be a lot madder. Well, we did just get back from a near-death experience. That'll do it. The fact that you've been spying on me seems kind of in in so inconsequential after that. Yeah, but there's this one night recorded on there. I think you'll probably want to see it. Ooh. And what night is that? What happened? Ooh, the making of Gumdraw, perhaps? Just watch it later when you get the chance. It's important. Okay. So, uh, are you ready to return home and finish the ultimate suite? <laughs> yeah, sorry to keep you waiting. Later, Butterscotch. Don't forget to bring me some when it's done. I won't forgive you if I don't get a taste of it. Get to Leave taste it. Believe me, you're getting some because your magic did everything. Hey, we're back. It's late. I was starting to get really worried. Oh, really? Oh, really? I am sorry to have a you, Master Paso, but we are working on a top secret surprise, so we will tell you all about our adventure when it is finished. A surprise? Okay then, I'll hold off on asking where you've been all day. Better. We'll be downstairs, so don't come in until we've finished working. I. Apua? So the surprise is a special treat. I should have guessed. Just try not to stay up all night. I know how you get when you're working on something big. Not only are we making something big, we're making the ultimate sweet. I don't need you to give yeah. me a bedtime. I'll sleep when it's done. Ultimate sweet. Syrup's enthusiasm for desserts is unmatched. Let us begin our work. Syrup and gumdrop retreat to the basement, <laughs> spending hour after hour preparing the ultimate sweet. She's like bashing the bowl with like a egg beater. <laughs> Finally, all that's left is to let it chill for night. Like that's not how you use an egg beater. We did good gumdrop, thanks, all, thanks for all your help. I am glad I could be of assistance. I can help you for Master Passio to try it. Yeah, me too. You stay here and keep an eye on this thing. I'm gonna go pass out. Roger that. 
Uh, I will see you in the morning. Oh. Now is a good chance to watch whatever is on this thing. Look. <laughs> Why would you not? Right? Oh. Let's see what Butterscotch wanted to show me. <gasps> that should be it. Did it work? Are you alive now? Yeah, I feel like I called this. Maybe I messed up the spell. Hello, master. What is your command? Oh, you're working. I I did it. Yeah, you you, you actually did call it in the beginning. In the beginning. <laughs> Please issue a command. Right, right. Uh, I didn't think this through. What's the best way to explain? Okay, I have this friend, she's not very sociable, and has kind of a thing against magic, so it's really hard for her to make friends here. Oh, I see. <laughs> Made her like a gun drop friend. Please issue a command. <laughs> yes, sorry. I guess what I'm asking is, if you make the... If maybe you could try, even then, though you're made from magic, you're also candy, so it should be okay, I think. So that's why you got all pissed. <laughs> you just eat her. <laughs> yeah. You just eat this thing. Okay. Unable to process. Please state your command clearly. Uh, I really should have thought this through better. Uh, please try to get along with my friend Syrup. <laughs> She's like, destroy all humanity. <laughs> <laughs> Unable to process. Please provide instructions on how to get along. Well, first of all, the way you talk is really unnatural. Try speaking more casually, you know, be friendly. Okay, here I go, here I go, here I go. How is this? Whoa. Better. Keep talking. That was crazy. I still do not understand what you want me to do, Matt. It's not too complicated. I'm sorry, I know golems aren't usually oh. used for things like this. I didn't have much of a choice. My friend hates talking to magic users. Oh, so you like hit it. You just hit it. He's like a filthy mage then. That's tight. Mm -hmm. Speaking yeah. of which, she absolutely cannot know that I made you. She still thinks I'm just like her and can't use magic. Wait, so this girl's like cleaning the like floor and like doing inventory? <laughs> okay, I will work hard. Right now, I think you're doing great. Just keep acting like a regular person and you'll be friends with her in no time. <laughs> what did she say? Wait, how does she get all, like, uh, acting like? Yeah, even though you're made of out of candy, it feels like I'm talking to a real human. Just keep being yourself. <laughs> be? Myself? <laughs> yep. Consider that to be your main objective. Hopefully, it's simple enough. Act human? But... But I am candy! Question? Be myself? Act like a person? I am candy. But... Act. Whoops, maybe it was too complicated. Uh, stop. Did I break you? This fried her. Fried did everything. Everything's fried. It's basically a computer. Looks like I messed it up again. This one seems so promising. I'd prob probably have better luck getting Sai to talk to other magic users than getting Golem to work right. So what do you do? You're just gonna like. Okay, this is, all this is a lot of candy. Go to waste, though. I guess I'll take it apart and. Brutal. I'll we'll just chop her up. But this one actually talked to me. She was sentient. Yeah, she was like, please give me a command. Remember that time? So cool. Hey, if I give up now, would it be like I killed you? Whoa, that's kind of deep. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, I won't give up on you. I won't give up on Syrup either. You're going to be friends somehow. I swear it. She's gonna like open up her candy brain and do some like candy lobotomy. <laughs> Syrup is still awake. It was very lonely down there. So I... What is that you are holding? That's... Now, 
You absolutely cannot know that. Why not? Master Pastel said you hate talking to magic users, so you absolutely cannot know. Forget, forget. I mean, yeah. I guess we were just on a mission though. Okay, okay, I forgot. You really forgot? Yep, I forgot. Yeah, you were made by that rotten witch as that elaborate prank, right? Yes! And not Master Pastel. He had nothing to do with it. I know. It was that witch, not Pastel, that good for nothing would it know the rest uh thing about making a magic golem. Master Pastel is not a good for nothing but other than that, you are exactly right. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> Syrup is laughing? What? It's just funny. He made you exactly my type. Ooh! Type, 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 confirm, type, 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 confirm, confirm. Well, uh, aside from your weirdo personality, he did not make me. You said you forgot. <laughs> I had to forgot for real this time, but now I'm going to have to thank Butterscotch instead. You are grateful? Yeah, I thought I was okay with just having Pastel around, but uh, making a new friend was kind of fun. Yeah, Candy Golem? Frick yeah. Friend? Uh, do you mean that at last we are getting along? <laughs> I think we have been for a while now. She's like, yes! Yes! My main quest and my task has been complete and you're only telling me just now. Yeah, your life's purpose is uh, done. I didn't know it was your task until a bit ago. Sorry. Oh, Master Pastel will be so happy to hear this. We should, it must have been for him right away. Wait. Question mark? I have a few questions for you about what you are. You are only following your creator's orders and acting friendly towards me, right? Or doesn't that mean it's all kind of fake after you tell him we've been getting along and he says that's enough, then is whatever this is just over? Yeah, like are you gonna like melt? Would you like to hear the honest answer, Sirp? Yeah, what's gonna happen? I don't know. At first I thought you were a very pushy and selfish person. <laughs> I worked very hard to be as friendly as I could, but I think that also makes me pushy and selfish like you. But there are many times uh, you have been kind to me when it did not serve you to do so. You also worked hard for Master Pastel to make the ultimate sweep. <gasps> I was instructed to act as human, although I am candy. But yeah, that blew your mind last time. Maybe that means I am not capable of sincere feelings. But you have always treated me well despite that. I would like to prove to you that I can also defy expectations. Ooh, what you gonna do? Uh, now I'm gonna go. Now I'm going to go wait by Master Pastel's bedside so that I may tell him the moment he wakes up that we have achieved getting along. <laughs> no, don't do that, creepy. Understood. To avoid seeming creepy, I will stand here in the dark until he comes downstairs. <laughs> You're just gonna like chill in the corner uh, and yeah. the way you put that sounds creepy too I guess you can't help it though huh this is creepy that is creepy I just cannot win with you syrup you should go to sleep and not worry about how I pass time well yeah she can't sleep so what else are you gonna do <laughs> alright alright see you in the morning whoa 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 so how was it <laughs> it, it's the best thing I ever tasted. Whoever came up with this recipe wasn't kidding about the ultimate part. <laughs> he's he's, he's reached he's reached enlightenment. <laughs> Reach enlightenment. I completely agree. I feel sort of bad that Gumdrop doesn't have any taste but zero greens. Oh, she can't eat. Uh, I am just happy to see the two of you enjoying it. I'm happy too. I thought you forgot about your promise to make this for me. Sigh. Thank you. Ain't hey, don't start getting all sappy over nothing. Gumdrop's the one who reminded me. Serving Master Pastel is of the utmost importance. Don't say things like that. You don't have to be so nice to me. Yeah, everybody knows. Okay, he's right. If we're too soft on him, he'll stop working so hard. Unacceptable! Now that I think of it, I actually have an errand for you. Take a serving of this stuff to butterscotch, okay? I promise I'd let her have a taste. Oh, she's about to, like... How generous of you. I'm happy to fulfill a request so nice. She's gonna turn to Buddha too. So Gumdrop, what do you want to do now that your uh, main objective is taken out? She's like, kill everyone. Huh, Master Pastel has not given me any other orders exactly. Kill everyone. I'm not talking about any orders. I mean, what do you want to do with your life? Kill everyone. Well, I was only created the other day, so I do not know. What do you think I should do, Syrup? Can't be the only... 
I can't be the one to decide that or else it defeats the entire purpose exactly. I just can't imagine you'd want to stay here and spend all your time working. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> yes, it would be unfortunate if I did not get to see all the wonderful things in those books from yesterday. <laughs> She's like flipping through like World War II books. <laughs> <laughs> but well, yeah. Kind of, you know, I would like to continue to strengthen mm -hmm. our bond, sir. I think Master Pastel would be pleased by that. Then maybe we could go uh, traveling together? You brought it up before, but actually thinking about it now, we definitely should go traveling. Let's go. But we cannot possibly leave the store unattended. Um, Pastel's better at running this place than I could ever be. If I leave instructions for making the candy, I'm sure he'd do just fine on his own. Yeah, he'd be making magic candy with his magic. And he could always hire someone in town if he needs help, even another rich if he has to. Considering he's been one all along, I've got nowhere to complain. No! You're not supposed to know about that, remember? Please forget! Uh -huh. Okay, I'm sorry. I won't mention it anymore. So what do you say? Want to go on a journey together? Mmm, yes. I would love that. Cute. And so, Syrup dismissed Gundrop from her job as shop assistant, and they began traveling the world together, selling candy along the way. So cute, she's got a little cape on. Pastel happily kept the store running on his own. <laughs> Studied Syrup's notes on candy making very closely to ensure that there would be no drop in quality while Syrup was away. <laughs> yeah, that candy better still be good. They like go on like a romantic getaway for like eight years, he's like taking care of a shop. <laughs> Being enlightened, Butterscotch, Butterscotch felt a little lonely with her rival out exploring the world, but at least Toffee was there to keep her company. Gumdrop band. Ooh, happy ending. <laughs> yeah, I got. Go. I straight up got a gumdrop end, boys, dude. Let's nice. Drink it. That. Oh, yeah. Oh, credits. There it is. That's right. it. Uh, story art by. I am. Nom nom nami, music by Markov. Two people, dude. Special thanks to Dark Chibi Shadow. Made in Renpi. Yup. Karawa Shoujo that is made in Renpi. Renpi. Wow. <laughs> well, that was Syrup and the Ultimate Sweet. It was surprisingly a very sweet story. Yeah, surprising. What do you think, Max? <laughs> it was really cute. This gumdrop person was cuter than I thought, even though I ate her in my first playthrough. I shouldn't have done that. A little precious little girl. Look, it's her endgame <laughs> outfit. I have her endgame outfit over here. Journey outfit. Yeah, so you unlocked the gumdrop ending yeah, outfit. I wonder if I can like use that outfit if I go to New Game Plus to reach the other like 10,000 other endings. Because I think there's like eight other, eight other endings that I would hit. So. Yeah, that's yep. true. Well, yep. Thanks for watching, though. Uh, like and subscribe if you want to see more of this type of content. And leave any comments if you have any comments in the section. See ya. Bye.